the people who spend money, when they spend money, they don't spend too much. And they're not cheap either. They're right in between. When you go shopping, you say, ah, I, I make good money. Put it all in. I'll take two of those. I'll take three of those. I'll take five of those. What's the biggest TV you have? I want a TV that doesn't even go through my door. <laughs> Give me that one. You know? <laughs> What's the most expensive car? What's the most, you know, you just want to show people how much money you got. You just want to pay, pay, pay. You can eat food at a restaurant, but you want to go to the restaurant where they charge you 200 rials to sit down first. You're spending too much. Spending too much. Right? Allah says the people who spend, but they're responsible when they spend. They're responsible when they spend. And they're not cheap either. You don't go to the store with your wife to get the cereal and the milk and the vegetables and she's putting milk and you're like, you're going to drink all that milk? You need all that milk? Get the small one. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> you know, don't be cheap either. You have to have a balance in your budget. Let me tell you something. The economic crisis in the world the fall of the European economy, the fall of the American economy that it's barely recovering from. You know where it came from? It came from people spending irresponsibly. And then institutions spending irresponsibly. And then governments spending irresponsibly. And saying we can just put it on the credit card, put it on the credit card, put it on the credit card. People got approved for mortgages for their homes far more than they can afford. And they said we're approved, go for it. You get, you get your credit check and you can lease a car. It's more expensive than you can afford, but hey, I, I'll just make the minimum payments. I'm okay. And people built upon this debt because they didn't spend. They spent outside of their means. Quran is teaching us. Quran is teaching us that when you spend money, don't spend money that's not in your pocket. Don't take loans. Don't be addicted to your credit card. Don't be like that. Spend within your means. Spend within your budget. You know? The only time the Muslim gets careful about spending is when they have to give sadaqah. That's the only time. The, you know, there's a, the, the, you know, the box is going around and people are collecting sadaqah for the masjid and you say, man, electricity bill, gas, school. There's so many, the whole budget for your family comes up in front of you. You become a certified professional accountant, <laughs> you know. But then when you go to the, the, the video game store or the electronic store, and you're buying the, the, new, the new phone, the tablet, or you're buying the movie or whatever, the whole budget doesn't come in front of your eyes. You don't say, what about the gas? What about the electricity? You just spend it. You just spend it. We have to be responsible spenders. We can't be cheap and we can't overspend. A lot of you, mashallah, are doing well financially. So you say to yourself, I can afford it. Just because you can afford it doesn't mean you should spend the money. Your money has other uses. You can, you can help your family. You have a lot of family back home that's not doing well. You can help them. You have, you have a lot of community over here that's financially not very well off. You can help them. You can help keep people get out of debt. Your money can do other good things. Instead of just buying yourself things. You know? You don't have to get the newest car. You don't have to. Just get a decent car. I'm not saying get a car that, you know, it's like, you know, the, uh, it might as well get a donkey instead of a car, but <laughs> no, don't get that kind of car either, get a decent car, but you don't have to get like all blinged out like a 350Z with like spinner rims and like, you know, neon lights and you're like slow down when you drive by and chill out, dude, just get a normal car, you know, don't go crazy, don't, oh, don't pay five times the price to buy the same kind of shirt because it has the logo on it. You know, it has the brand on Come on, man, they were made in the same factory. They're playing with you. They're messing with you. If you think that you're, you get some more value when you wear a different brand. Don't be duped by these things. You know, be reasonable. You don't have, people, you know, the people like to buy at expensive stores and they like to carry the bag from the expensive store. And they like to rave it extra more. Some people are like, oh, that store. Okay, yeah, yeah, this guy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> They maintain a healthy, normal, responsible budget in between. And we have to teach this to our kids. We have to teach this to our kids. Don't just give your kids money. Baba, can I have 20 riyal? Nobody even asks for 20. They probably ask for 100 nowadays, right? What is a 20? Look at 20 like. What is that?